Hello everyone, uh, this is Aaron again. This is the second program in the series. Uh, today we will uh, use again the, uh, the Visual Studio 2012 uh, and we will create a program. Um, we'll do like some text boxes, we'll uh, practice text boxes and uh, buttons. Um, uh, the program we will do like it's called um, uh, what we want to do like we want to text in a specific text box and then a click a uh, the button and move the same text we are writing to the second one um, this is a uh, visual window 2012 we start by clicking on new project and we want to do it on the window phone now of course we want to do it in the language of C sharp. We choose the uh, window form applications. Let's name the program. Let's say text box. Okay. And then we go here. Uh, we can change the locations of where we want to save the program. And the solution name is text box. We click OK. This one, be sure it's, it's uh, checked, create uh, the directory for the solution. Say OK. <coughs> now, of course, uh, it's a little bit more complicated than the um, just hello world or something. Uh, we'll be using uh, two buttons, one uh, to move the text and the other one to clear to clear the text. I'm sorry. Anyway, um, let's do this now. We have this one here, the... Um, I'm sorry. Now we have, this is the window form. We want to do the program on. Uh, as you see, we can resize it either by this way or using on the corner if we hold the mouse we can use it like we can change the size any way you want as you see this is form one we can change the name let's change it here with the with the properties we can change it to let's say text box program or whatever you want to do you can click uh, you can do uh, a click enter and that as you see here on the form the name is changed uh, from the toolbox let's choose let's pick I have two buttons and let's do two text boxes as you see here the first one as you see, like when you look at the property, it's called text box two. And this is, as you see here, text box one. And it's very important to know what the name, because this is when we want to code the program that should work together. Let's put here, we have button one, button two. Let's resize a little bit uh, these. Let's make them a little bit nicer and the buttons as you see like it's lined here that will tell you that you are on on the right size and we will do the same here and same on the second button now what we want to do with this program of course you can just hold your mouse and do it this way. Well, as you see, all these buttons, you can hold it and move them around on the phone. Let's put them in the middle. Looks nicer. Now, we wanna, what we want to do in this program? We want to put text and text box one. Click this button, and whatever we write here will move to text box two. And then we need to clear the uh, the text. Let's change the names here. Um, on this text box one, if we go to the property on the text, 
let's change it here to OK. And let's call this one in the property. Let's go to the right screen and let's call it clear. Now, as you see, we have to do two functions here. We have to code this one to move the text from text box one to text box two and then clear both text boxes. So let's double click on this button and start um, coding the program. As you see here, right away, said like button one this, uh, to define the event. Let's say um, text text box two dot text equal text box one dot text and be sure you close the things with the line with semicolon here. Okay? Now whatever we write on the text box one will be equal to the text box two. So we are moving the text from text box one to text box two. It's very simple, very easy. Now let's try see if that will work. We debug the program. Now it will open for us. Here you go. Now we have this OK. We have here, let's say, hello, and click OK. Here you go. The hello moved here. You see? If you add hello, Adam, you click OK. We say Adam. Now, if we click clear, there's nothing happening because still we didn't add any codes to the event here to clear the text boxes. Now let's do it. We go back to the uh, form one and we double click on the clear button. So what we say, we say like text box one dot clear as see with it the clear and we put parentheses here with a semicolon and let's clear again the the second text box okay so text box one dot clear text box, text box two dot clear and you have to put the uh, semicolon here. Let's run the program, see that if that will work. We debug it again. There you go. Say like hello. And click OK. This is the hello. Let's see if this button will function with the code we put. Clear? It's clear. It's very simple, very easy. I hope that will be beneficial for you. If you have any question, please send me an email to Aaron at sandprosolutions.com. Aaron at sandprosolutions.com. Or you can put your uh, feedback if you have any question and see C-sharp programming. Uh, thank you and have a great day.